So at this point, we've pretty much set up our entire control scheme. And I'd like you to just kind of remember what I said earlier on, if I jump back to this graphic here, that our actors inside our scene, the ones that we're actually pressing and touching, are controlling an attribute, and it can be any attribute that you create, and that attribute is driving other actors inside our scene, which is really once you understand this concept you can use it over and over and over in a million ways not just to simply move a character up and down or make it grow or rotate you, once you get familiar with all the different behaviors inside game salad you're going to be using this concept over and over so even though we're pretty much done with the entire control setup there is one other last thing that I'd like to do here and that's kind of changing the state of our actor now you notice the letter A as I move him up and down, he's always facing one direction. He's kind of, the A is always facing up. So let's set it up so that when we turn him to the left, he actually faces the left, and we move him to the right, he moves to the right, and when he moves down, he faces down. And this is really simple. You'll notice that when you imported your images here, you had a few other images. And what we're going to do is double click on our letter A actor. and we want to add in a little bit more to each one of these rules here that we set up earlier. So basically I'm going to open up the up rule and when the game controls attribute has the letter up we have it set up right now so that he moves in the up direction but what we want to do is also set up a new behavior where we change the image of the actor so you'll see that we have this change image behavior that I'm going to drag up into this up rule that we created. Now when we have this character moving up, which image do we want? Now this might be a little bit confusing because we already have the correct image, but let's set this to be the up image. And then for right, of course, we are going to add the change image and we're going to set this to be right and for down we'll do another change image behavior so for down we'll switch this to down of course and then for left one more time change image and choose the left image so you can see if we preview this now, when we move up, he moves up. When we move to the right, not only does he move to the right, but he also faces the right. Same with the left. And of course with pushing down. So imagine if you had a ship or a tank driving around the scene. Now you know how to get it to not only move in that direction, but also face in that direction properly as well. And then I'll just get our A back where it needs to be to finish up this tutorial.